the Saturday wrap, the Saturday wrap for Saturday the 13th of April 2024. Last week, I think it was a little bit dark. Possibly this week, I'm a little bit bright. Who knows? Anyway, as per normal, recording this the day before, and the day before the 12th, it's the first day of official spring. And according to Wales Online, the hottest day of the year so far. Not that it had anything to beat, but there you go. Anyway, uh, this is me looking back at the week, the weather, the tech, the more tech, a little bit of the politics, and lots of gardening and beer. So there you go. Anyway, so let us start with the word or phrase of the week. And it's the first time this has happened to me. I got pig butchered. Well, I didn't fall for it. However, if you don't know what that means, it means fattening you up and killing you. So you get a text from someone and it seems to be addressed to someone else. Mine said, uh, was it a doctor? Evelyn referred me on. So you go, oh, must have the wrong number. Let me contact them back. And then they start being nice to you within a week. They're either wanting to mor uh, mor borrow, money, borrow money or a um, crypto scam. Yeah, if you get anything like that, delete them. That's the way forward. Pig butchering. Anyway, so the app of the week, I think I've mentioned before, Airdrop. It's one of the things that Apple has and keeps you in their infrastructure um, you can just transfer pictures and files and that between machines and it's really easy and um, there is an open source equivalent local send um, which works with android and windows and such like i couldn't get it to work on apple <laughs> i really couldn't however i do have airdrop but local send uh, recommended um, by quite a lot of people just apart from me but if you need to transfer between Android and Windows and such like, or Android and Linux, uh, local send. Anyway, the thing of the week. So Saturday, I ordered some potting compost from Amazon because I was fed up of going to the garden center and getting some and bringing it back. Um, it turned out to be a really good plan. I also ordered some pots as well. I thought they were all coming because they were all prime together. Turns out the potting compost, uh, and they did say this would come on Monday via Amazon. The pots via Royal Mail were also supposed to come on Monday. Didn't arrive until Thursday. Royal Mail, look, you're in a competition. You have to do at least as good, and if not better. Worse is, you're out of it. You can forget it. Um, you're a private company now. You've got to stand up. Hmm. There you go. Song of the week. Um, time and a place. Uh, time and a place is when I was a lot younger, a Friday night, a Radio 2 went over to Radio 1 on FM. It was the Friday rock show. And there was a competition on there. The Friday Connection, I think it was. And the theme music, theme one from Van de Graaff Generator. It's brilliant. It's proggy. Um, I don't think there'll be any disagreement with that, although I stand to be proved wrong. But Van de Graaff Generator, really, really excellent. Anyway, um, so I've already mentioned on Saturday, Amazon Compost. Uh, 35 litres came in a double wrap bag. <laughs> really, really, really good. I must stop saying really, really. Um, and I went to the bus stop to go to Newport to catch the 50, and the 50 is now the 50A. Well, it is at 2528. So that means it goes all through the gear and then along the road and past the hospital and probably gets you into Newport 10 minutes later and you don't go anywhere near the station. So if you want to get to Newport and go to the station, you're probably looking at catching an earlier or later bus. Great news. I'm sure there's a good reason for it, but I can't think of it at the moment. Um, didn't really stay out that long on Saturday, and I thought, I'm going to come home. I came home and mowed the lawn, the first mow of the year. I planted some more Casablancas, my first early potatoes, and watered them. There you go. Um, as Sunday, ordered strawberry plants. I've had an email today to say they've been dispatched. 
Now, will I get them tomorrow or will I get them on Monday? Hmm, got half a bag of compost left. I'm hoping Monday, to be perfectly honest. Uh, there you go. Um, Tuesday, ordered moss killer and lawn tonic. Came the next day, came by Amazon. And I've been out in the back garden today um, with the uh, watering can, putting some on. You can only put it on, I think it's twice a year. It must be at least six weeks apart. Uh, there is some moss on there and there's some bits and pieces that really need some tonic. Um, and I have a feeling within a week I will be scarifying. Scarifying like the wind, to be perfectly honest. Uh, also on Tuesday, my trainers, they started to come apart. I think I've had them for 15 months and normally expect them to only last a year because that tends to be all I wear out of doors nowadays. So having them for 15 months instead of 12 months wasn't bad, although they seem to have gone up in price. I looked up what I had before, went on Amazon, ordered them next day and a spare pair of laces. <laughs> I think that's really good. Um, and the laces are much shorter as well, which is good because the old ones were far too, far too long. There you go. Um, Thursday, my pots from Royal Mail finally arrived. And today, spring. Spring and watering can and moss killing and... Yeah. Anyway, um, appeared on another... Well, got mentioned on another podcast this week. Um, it was Podcast Weekly. Uh, with James Cridland and Sam Seppi, and it all got a bit meta. And on that thought, thank you very much for watching. Ooh, seven minutes a bit long. Uh, right, um, bye-bye. Ooh, comments, as per normal.